The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, has described the activities of illegal miners operating in Kwara State as a great threat to the national economy. The acting executive chairman of the anti-graft agency, Abdul Karim Chukul, raised the alarm during a one-day workshop on effective reporting of economic and financial crimes organized for 27 selected journalists drawn from different media organizations in the state. The activities of illegal miners operating in Kwara State, which drew the attention of the workshop organizers, is one which the EFCC says it will continue to combat through extant laws describing the activities of the illegal miners as a national economic threat that must be tackled in a holistic way. In the Kwara State environment, the activities of illegal solid mineral operators pose grave threats to the local and national economy. Do a non-payment of true non-payment of royalty, taxes, and other dues. The Commission has been active in tackling their criminalities and we continue to ensure that extant laws against all legal minors. The Commission says the need to develop capacity for journalists has become imperative at this critical period of nation building, noting that such capacity building will help improve the investigative skills of journalists in tackling the menace of corruption in the country. It's a crime that is hitting eight trillion US dollar globally. If cybercrime was a country, they say it is next to US and China. So we're talking about a very big issue. So and Nigeria is not spared of this challenge. The total debt of investigative journalism. Journalism, to all intents and purposes, we know that a journalist what is the strength, the dimension, the solidity, the adequacy of his investigation. Government are taking up measures and responded in the way that we have this law now that tries to regulate the process. And as journalists, we have the duty to help strengthen the system so that all these measures will work. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.